We are also following the latest developments in the Las Vegas massacre investigation. Yes, newly released documents name an Arizona ammunition dealer as a person of interest in this case. 55-year-old Douglas Haig of Mesa admits to selling hundreds of rounds of ammo to shooter Stephen Paddock, but he says he had no idea that his customer would commit the deadliest mass shooting in U.S. history. News 4 Tucson's Aliyah Shahid has more. Newly released court documents list only two people as additional persons of interest in the Las Vegas shooting. One is the shooter's girlfriend, Mary Lou Danley. The other is Douglas Haig, an ammo dealer located right here in Arizona. Haig says he sold more than 700 rounds of tracer ammo to gunman Stephen Paddock, but insists that's as far as their connection goes. I handed him a box of the, with the ammunition in it and he paid me and he left. Haig first admitted to selling the ammunition in October when 12 News tracked him down at his Mesa home. He says Paddock told him he was using the rounds to put on a light show. The guy appeared as normal as your grandfather. He looked so. pretty normal? Looked normal, acted normal, spoke normal, clean cut, easy going, nice guy, uh, never suspected anything. Haig says he was contacted by authorities the day after the deadly shooting and fully cooperated. He says he has no idea why they would name him as a person of interest and it remains unclear if he's still under investigation. I felt that they were hoping that they could find a connection between myself and Paddock. They're not going to find it. And law enforcement officials in Las Vegas maintain their belief that Stephen Paddock acted alone. Douglas Haig is planning to hold a press conference with his attorney this Friday to answer any questions on his involvement in the case. Aliyah Shahid, News for Tucson.